everyone, and welcome to the starting grid from the Charlotte Road Course. Chris, this track's a big unknown. We saw a lot of people getting into a lot of stuff. What can we expect from race day? We definitely gonna expect that to happen throughout the entire race because what we call high confidence, low grip situation. They have a lot of confidence because they had Charlotte Motor Speedway, everyone, but the tire and everything else is like we're at a road course. So these guys have a lot of confidence and it's gonna be a great race. What happens at the end, we don't know, but it's gonna be exciting to watch. All right, one word for you, chicane. There's one on the back, there's one on the front. What makes those so difficult here? Well, it's kind of like everything that's here. It is big and it is dangerous and it's exciting. That's what it is, and they have to do that for the speed. Well, it doesn't look like any of the guys want to be slowed down going through the back chicane, and they run into the wall. They try to get through that too fast. That wall just keeps moving. All right, now a question about film study. How much of these guys pay attention to your Xfinity race? Go back and watch that tape to figure out where they can make moves. I feel like every cup driver watched the Xfinity race. They watched it last night. They knew what was going on. They're going to play off of that race. They're going to see how that race worked. I'm excited that we could do that for them. It's going to be exciting to watch. Qualifying on Friday was exciting. Kurt Busch, he edged out that pole. How impressive was his run? Well, that was real impressive. But like A.J. Allmendinger, which is on the outside pole, said, they're searching for a job, everyone. I was excited to watch him. He went through the back chicane just as smooth as anyone. But that shows me that the Stewart Haas cars are fast here, just like they are everywhere else. All right, who are you picking this weekend? Well, you know what? I'm still going with Kyle Busch. Has nothing to lose. I watched him go through all the racetrack. If he does not get into trouble and he does not hit any of these walls, Kyle Busch will dominate this race. Are right, you holding on to something? I'm taking Daniel Hemrick to win. Oh, boy. I, I think the eight car can get it done. It'd be a great story this weekend. The eight car back in victory lane. Why not at Charlotte? Why not for Richard Schilder? Chris, thanks for joining us. Be sure to tune in to the race at the Charlotte Road Course. It's at 2 p.m. Eastern time today on NBC.